What if Pectus Excavatum, the sunken chest condition affecting 1 in 400 children, became severe in most cases instead of just 15%? Playgrounds would fall silent as children struggled to breathe during simple games of tag. Chest pain would force kids to sit out activities they once loved. Pediatric hospitals would be overwhelmed with emergency chest reconstruction surgeries. Entire wings would be converted just to handle the massive influx of young patients. Parents would cancel swimming lessons and beach trips to avoid exposing their children's appearance. Kids would develop severe anxiety about their bodies, refusing to participate in sports entirely. Insurance companies would face bankruptcy from the surge in costly reconstructive procedures. Schools would redesign physical education programs around breathing limitations, external chest bracing devices would become standard newborn equipment like car seats. Fortunately, this nightmare scenario remains fictional. Early detection and monitoring currently prevent most severe cases from requiring surgery. Regular pediatric checkups catch progression before hearts and lungs become compressed.